Good afternoon. I'm Kim Baez. Police are on the hunt for an armed robber, a robber who carried out quite a beating on two convenience store clerks. Police are now plastering the crook's face all over the news and hope someone will help identify him. News 13's Alex Tomlin is live in the newsplex with the story. Kim, the suspect didn't take it easy on the elderly clerk or her co-worker. Take a look at this surveillance video of the crime. It was just after 9 o'clock on Sunday night when the man enters the Circle K in the 300 block of Wyoming Northeast. He immediately knocks down the 61-year-old clerk and makes his way behind the counter. He then tells the other clerk to open the registers. He comes back to the woman and kicks her in the face. He then punches the mail clerk a few times and flees. So what made this brutal assault worth it to this crook? He only made off with 200 bucks, two packs of cigarettes. He wasn't the only person stealing that night, though. At the same time this was going down, there was a crime of opportunity perpetrated by another individual that you're going to see on videotape. That individual took what appeared to be uh, a quantity of alcohol and left out the door. While they're looking for both men, Walsh says finding the weapon-carrying crook is their first priority. He was bold enough to go in and assault and batter both the clerks. Uh, he was very demanding, as you can well see, very violent. This is the type of individual we must uh, get information on just as soon as possible. The suspect is described as a 30-year-old Hispanic male. He's 6 feet tall, about 220 pounds. He was wearing baggy jeans, black and white sneakers, and an inside-out brown hoodie. Kim? Okay, thanks, Alex. Now, if you recognize the suspect in the surveillance video, you are asked to call Albuquerque Police at 242-COP.